going on everybody what's happening what's happening hope everybody's having an amazing Thursday happy Thursday everybody got a new hat been looking for a bucket hat for a hot minute but anyway welcome to or welcome back to Kovacs Corner appreciate you taking the time to come through and hang out with Chubb Boy especially on a Thursday uh, feel free to hit me up on any one of my social media platforms down in the description below uh, if you want to support the channel, feel free to hit up the PayPal. Don't feel obligated to. A like and a sub is all I need. So, we're back at it with Pokemon Crystal. You already know. Yo, what's going on, Marco? What's going on, Dem? Who's that? What's going on, Brown Man? What's happening, G? You already know. But yeah, no, man. We're about to hop back into Pokemon Crystal. So, thank God I had that one save file where we ended up catching the Sudowoodle. Uh, I already went up off to the right hand side I uh, collected the red black and blue apricot I think whatever the berry is already got it uh, man I've been dealing stressful with this game during the rolling blackouts because there's been a few times I've been playing the game because uh, we have a Growlithe I had Growlithe up to level 19 the one dude that's just underneath where we are like literally just down here gave me a call he had a firestone i had it i had everything ready i was going to stream it because i don't want to evolve any pokemon without including you guys because you guys are along for the ride as well uh yeah man <laughs> rolling back out got rid of all that all that uh, it's 4 30 uh i don't know let me take a look it's just about, it's 427 where I'm at. Because I'm in Ontario, Canada. It's where we at. We're not in Toronto, but we're in the GTA. I grew up in South Etobicoke. It's in Toronto, the West End. But anyway, 
yeah man also I'm gonna be changing my display picture I'm gonna have uh, in the community section I'm gonna have a poll on a couple of cards that I'm gonna be holding you guys get a pick honestly my personal favorite I just finished pulling a uh, Dragoon so I think that's probably gonna win it all and all that in one second So I ended up start working back out a little bit to help me with my sciatica because I got sciatica and I noticed the difference. Cat's doing a lot better, Boo's doing a lot better. He's like up walking around a little bit more. Just giving you guys a quick little rundown about what's going on. Yeah, he's doing a little bit better. Well, like a lot better. He's able to use his litter now. Uh, he's up, he's walking around and stuff. He's eating his solid food. I feed him twice a day in the morning and like around 4, 4.30 p.m. depending. Uh, he gets fresh tuna, which is keeping him sustained. He's drinking water and all that. He's, he's looking really good. But just give you guys a quick little heads up what's happening. Switch up the demeanor a little bit. You know what I mean? All right, we're about to get into this. So a good majority of this is gonna be grinding. We're gonna have to grind out a, like some levels, get our Pokemon up. We're going to do the Dancing Sisters on top of the gym. We also got uh, the two towers here, the Burnt Tower and the Silver Tower, I'm pretty sure. And we get the, we get to decide whether or not we want the Silver Wing or the Gold Wing, I'm pretty sure. All right, it's been a hot minute. Got a new Bagel Poppy. I haven't been able to stop by in a while. Yo, that's cool, bro. You got a new, new puppy. Bugle, nice. Beagle, my bad. What I want to ask about. So, generally, like anime, but I want to ask you ahead, like always, do you like GTA games? Have good influences on kids? So, I grew up with GTA. Vice City, San Andreas, even back in the day when it was on uh, PC and they had uh, it was like top down 2D animations and stuff we have to go heal our Pokemon uh, top down 2D for PC way back in the day it wasn't even considered PC it was just a computer uh, it all depends it all depends that's how I feel about it. If your kid knows the difference between right and wrong, and what's real, what's make-believe, then it's like, whatever, man. I grew up playing violent video games. I'm not really a violent person. Only one need to be, <laughs> right? But yeah, no, man. It all depends on how people raise their kids, in my opinion. San Andreas was the best. And that's again my opinion. Let's see if we have a bug catching contest going on. Because if we have a bug catching contest, we do have a bug catching contest. Yo, nice. What Pokemon should we use? We got Slasher in the lead right now, 17. That's our Scyther. Batman's level 20. Gator, double D Gator, level 22. Flappy's 14. Nox is 18. And Entei Jr. So we're gonna switch out, and we are going to use our Growlithe. It's not Saturday; it's Thursday. But like this game's so far behind with the way how I've saved it, I had to reboot it, restart it, all this other shit. I've been lucky enough that I was able to uh, save it right at the Suda Widow. So hopefully, I'll be able to save it again. And that's, that's with these buttons down here, right? Download state, upload state. Uh, I've done the download state before, like even after when I had Growlithe up and stuff, I did it, but outage happened right as I was doing it, so it didn't save. So we won our last one by catching a Scyther. Let's see if we catch a Pinsir this time. Because if we get catch a Pinsir, that would be pretty dope. Yeah, GTA 4. GTA 4 is pretty sick, I ain't gonna lie, it's a pretty dope game. 
Hit him with the ember. Also, I'm going to start making uh, a bunch of life changes that's going on at the moment. Where it's like uh, working back out. Can't believe you did that. Working back out. I'm going to cut drinking. I don't really drink too much, but I did start again due to stress and whatever. So, like, a glass of red wine's fine. Like, once in a while, but not all the time. Uh, I did pick up smoking cigarettes again, which is really bad because I quit for about a year. Uh, yeah, nah, man, that, that really sucks. When I started that again, I'm going to have to quit that. I'm going to cut back on my weed consumption, even though I do use it for, like, a medical purpose. Work it back out. Got to stay in shape and get back to it because I do need to, uh, need to get a new job. I know I could go back to my old job, but I don't think I really want to go back there. I love everybody there. It was a great experience, great people, but can't do it if my back's fucked like that. Man, we are not running into a pincer at all. Hopefully we get into Junior up a bit. It sucks that he's poisoned too at the moment. Nice. You're talking about with uh, Nico, right? GTA 3? No, you're talking about GTA 4. How oh, it's sad and stuff. <clears throat> well, that's some of the stories, right? That's how GTA plays. I kind of got bored of GTA 5, right? Like, I had it online and everything. I was playing it for a hot minute, but then it's like, they want you to pay a bunch of money towards it. And I don't like to pay money towards games unless I'm actually into the game. Kind of like uh, with Apex Legends for the season. You got to purchase the season. You don't have to, but like if you want those skins and stuff, you're going to purchase the season. Whatever it is, what it is. Let me see something. Man, I do not have... Growlithe might die before we even catch any Pokemon. Ooh, it's a bee drill. Big dick bee. It's a female too with a dick. Hit him with the ember. Come on, Entei Jr. I'm pretty sure this is the town where we also release uh, the legendary dogs. Missed. Uh, we'll hit him with bite. Yeah, it's GTA 3. And with one more bite, should be alright. Don't die. I'm hurt by poison. Flinched, nice. Park ball. Oh my gosh. I'm hurt by poison. We're going to have to restart this. Yeah, I'm not going to take an L like that, man. Watch, you'll see. We'll get a phone call. Oh, I saved it for after the phone call. Nice. So now that we know that the bug kitchen contest is on, or I could save it and I could do it as a mini series. Also, we got the new tins out. What is it? Tomorrow? 
we got the new 2023 Yu-Gi-Oh! 10s out. I'm going to be getting a couple of those. Whoops. Dante Jr. Give me one second here. One second. Leave the TV on out there for the cat, so he has something to listen to. He doesn't have to feel alone when he's just out there. And it sucked because we had a thunderstorm the other day. Man, I woke up at like three o'clock in the morning. Okay, well, bug catching contest isn't on. It's whatever. Well, I'll save that. I'll save the bug catching contest. More content. Also, we'd have to go back in here. red one, bottom one's the black one, I'm pretty sure, this one's the blue one, yeah. If anything, if that's something that you feel that you would want to see is some GTA action, Grand Theft Auto, let me know because I have my PS4 and I would end up running uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas and I would have to sit through and play that game all the way through. Done it a couple times. That or Red Dead Redemption. Well, Red Dead 2 is the one that I got. And that's that game's a masterpiece in my opinion. Also this morning, how early I woke up thunderstorm bugging the cat and stuff right he was scared um, wait he was scared and I have to make sure he doesn't get into this one laneway where he was before when all this like happened to him right I don't want him over there because the way how it's looking is like he probably ate a bug so we had a bunch of new people move into the building from the city and stuff obviously bringing bugs from the other location where a bunch of people have been complaining about the bugs I don't have bugs in my apartment I'm not about that life keep it clean uh, but yeah the way it's looking the way how it, his nerve system is looks like he ate a bug that was covered in poison on top he has an inner ear infection which sucks for him but he had like mites when we first got him in his ear and we dealt with that but he does have like a, a ear problem. I've been cleaning his ear and stuff too. But yeah, no, I just didn't want him to go over there when I went out to go and take a look to see whether or not he was laying down on uh, on his area. He wasn't. I had to go and look for him and he was trying to get over there. And it was like, haha, nah, buddy. Can't do that. Good thing I put like a blockade in it in front of it. Yeah, no, man, he's been doing better. Like, he walked from his area over to my room. I don't know if this is out the door or if it's just a breeze and I'm tripping. It's just a breeze and I'm tripping. But he walked over here. I was in the living room, mind you. Uh, Walked over here, came, laid down in the room for a little bit, got up, walked over to the washroom because how hot it is, it's cooler in the washroom. So over there for a bit, walked over to the kitchen, uh, went back to his area, dinner time, came back to the kitchen to eat because he eats on the floor in the kitchen. Not on the floor, it's in a container, but he eats in the kitchen, the tuna. So in case he ends up dropping any, I could just pick it up and wipe it down. Instead of over in his area where there's some towels and stuff, we got those wet mats underneath the towels in case he can't make it to the litter, but now he's been able to. I was able to cut out 
the entranceway of his litter a little bit so that's easier for him to get in and out of it with a little ramp on it. It's pretty, pretty jokes. It's doing good. But yeah, for Grand Theft Auto, the best game. Vice City was really good. Vice City was actually really, really good. Uh, I used to, like I used to fall asleep playing that game. <laughs> that was a really good game. Uh, but then everybody knew all the cheat codes for it. I knew all the cheat codes for it. So like it was super easy. But uh, San Andreas is the one that I would play because there's a bunch of side quests. You got the little gang areas that you gotta deal with on top of getting kidnapped, dropped out of town. Uh, I got the remastered one even though like the graphics aren't that remastered. Let's do it. Aw oh, man, hit me with that disabled. My bite's disabled? Get burned for that shit. Also, I don't know if I'm going to do it this upcoming weekend or I'm going to wait another week. But we're going to do a marathon stream. Well, I'll probably start anywhere between 7.30, 8 o'clock in the morning, maybe 9 o'clock in the morning. <clears throat> it all depends. That's not cool. Got rid of N.T. Jr. like that, you bitch. Send out knots. And we're pretty much going to go the whole day. Uh, if it happens to be a 24-hour stream, then cool, but I'll pretty much end up getting off when I when I feel tired but I think we'll end up going probably till like 10 11 o'clock maybe midnight so he could use it on me but I can't use it on him get the fuck out of here bro gosh darn drowsies Gonna have to go to the Pokemon Center for this. Knox gain experience. Defeat it. Alright. Because I think that there's one more trainer that we need to face. But I want Growlithe to start getting levels. Because if we get an RK9, that'll be so good for our roster. And tomorrow we're going to be playing some Master Duel. But I am hopping on Duel Links tonight, like off stream. I usually try to hit that up every day. I'm trying to build a couple new decks. Went through a good majority of my Yu-Gi-Oh cards this morning where I was able to separate all the spell and trap cards from all the monster cards. So I'm going to have to go through the monster cards. I'm like trying to make a couple decks right now too. I'm trying to do Pearly because uh, it was used in tournament and it like placed. So I wouldn't mind using that for doing the locals at the upper hand because all I got is the Dark Magician deck that I've been using. And it's a dope deck. I love that deck, but for the cards that these kids are playing, it's, it's ridiculous. Like flipping, flipping cards, Link Summon, Link Summon, uh, Synchro Summon, XZ Summon, Link Summon, Link Summon, Effect, 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 Effect. It's like, Jesus. Should have kept Nibiru in the deck. Alright, we're in a new town. So since we're in the new town, after we talk to uh, Asshole here, 
pretty sure we named him Silver, right? Oh no, never mind, it's Bill. He's just talking about the trading system. This one, everyone thought that they'd be able to trade uh, all the new Pokemon over to red, blue, and yellow. A lot of games got corrupted. Because it ends up turning into Missigno. And uh, if Pokemon's holding something, it messed up. So, let's download state. Save as. So that should work. Hopefully it works. didn't work we're stuck at the Sotovudo location speaking of I'm gonna get rid of Flappy we'll keep Knox we will deposit our Flappy No, I thinking about it. I should have named him Hardwood. <laughs> Let's see something. Right, so he doesn't have it yet. Uh, he can't learn it. Knox can though. Scythe already has a track we could get rid of. We'll teach Rollo to a Pokemon. Perfect. What moves does he have? Rock Throw, Mimic, Flail. Get rid of Flail. Headbutt's an attack that could be given to anyone. Batman can't learn it, neither can Knox because they're flying Pokemon. Oak Tree can learn it. No, we're going to hold on to it right now. We're going to save. Three badges of 23 in our Pokedex. We have not been playing for over seven hours, but you know, that's times when I'm letting the game run in the background. And we also are going to do the Eevee Kimono Sisters, which will end up getting us some levels on Ultra, Ultra Ball. So right now all we're doing is leveling our Pokemon, mostly our Growlithe. I want to level up Growlithe, I want to get that Firestone, and I want that Entei. We need Entei. We need Entei. And I need someone to like set my whole system up here for streams where it'd be a lot better, more interactive and stuff. Because I don't understand how to do any of it. <laughs> learning as I go but uh, I don't fully understand everything that's going along with it nice and I'm pretty sure bite super no nah, it's not super effective I thought it was because we just seen See how Ember does. Ah, bites better. 
Yeah, you bite, I bite back. I'm a dog, son. Hit me with that leech life. Can't believe it. But yeah, so there's going to be a new display picture across all of my social medias. I'm going to save that other one. But I am going to have some cards for you guys to pick out where I should take the picture with it. I should have grabbed an escape rope, but we'll find our way out. Not too concerned about it. Fucking Geodude. Ether, nice. We're not going to need it till later on in the game. Like Mount Silver is what we need to use all that. Oh, look, it's a gold bat. Gold bat. Look how weak he is. Level 13. Goddamn Super Sonic. And Dig doesn't work. Attack. Go Nox. Get Nox on this Mamma Jamma Ray here. Forget this Golbat. This Golbat don't have nothing on our Zubat. He's going to be a Golbat pretty soon. This might be super effective. No. Well, we're just going to peck him to death. That's how we're going to do that. The only time I would end up catching a gold bat is if he was shiny, because I'm pretty sure they had they had shiny variants in this. From what I can recall, my recollection, first time playing silver, that little tunnel, uh, si the silver onyx, really sparkled. So shiny onyx. This is before we even knew what shiny Pokemon were. I have a couple friends of mine right now that are trying to get me to get into Pokemon cards. But I like Yu-Gi-Oh cards, man. They're cooler. Way cooler. We'll battle this dude. They're cooler. There's more that you can do with them. It's more of a fun game, in my opinion. But I might grab a couple booster boxes. But I know that because uh, they just let out... 2023 10 tomorrow even though it's already been out seeing the openings and stuff i'm gonna be getting a few of those because the pulls that you get in there you spend like 25 bucks on that tin and then like you're pulling cards that are like 30 dollars so i'll make my money back cards that I don't need and then I could have a couple cards for like prize cards uh, double D gator hmm go Knox because Knox is a G man Hit Nox two times, Nox hit him with the hypnosis, homie. Don't let it kill him. Yes. Alright, we are going to peck. We'll get a couple attacks off. I hit pretty heavy, fast asleep. Please stay asleep for three more turns. So how's everybody's Thursday? How's your Thursday treating everybody? Marco, Brown Man, Dem, how's how's Thursday? Yo, Dem, that's so sick about having a beagle. Yo, their little floopy ears and stuff, man. They're so adorable. Do you hunt at all? As well. Because they're good hunting dogs.
what's his and or her name as well. I love animals, man. Animals are so cool. <coughs> I like animals more than I like people. If I could, I'd have a big house with some land and just like a bunch of animals. Maybe one day. If YouTube picks up and like kicks off for me, that's what I do. And then I do like ATV trips around doing like jobs and stuff and I do videos of that too. On top of our Yu-Gi-Oh and other gaming content that we would be doing, let's throw a Batman. Go Batman Double X. Woo, titties! <laughs> Run your double kick, it has no effect. Very minute. Hit you with a Confuse Ray. You feel GTA 4 has real soprano vibes going on with the theme? Yeah, no, that's uh, it's GTA 3, isn't it? Marco, or whatever his name is. Because that was a good, like, I had a, I used to have this girlfriend, it's like, eight, nine years ago. And she was super into that game. She would play that game all the time. And then when GTA 5 came out, Battlefield 4 came out at the same time. I bought both games. And I was like, you could have GTA, I want Battlefield. And then we each played GTA. Which was like crazy, we had our own save files. Ah, she killed that game, man. She was really good, same, same as Skyrim. She was running Skyrim for the Xbox. Fucking killed it. But I was more into like San Andreas. GTA 5 was alright. I got boring after playing a couple years though. You know, like a couple years of playing it gets super boring. There's only so much that you can do. All I was really doing was drug runs anyway. Drug runs, diamond heist. Uh, you were able to play the stock market a little bit as you're doing Lester missions. So I do the stock market, Lester missions, do the wheel every day. And it got to the point where I was like, man, this is kind of boring. I, too many people online. Then it started diminishing. So I stopped playing. The role plays were coming around the time I was like taking a step back but I was like super into Battlefield 4 right and that was my jam I used to I was fourth in the world using the QBB 95 one at the time it's like 2016 I think and I was like overall top percentile in using tank I was like five percent top five percent or top three percent using the tank something like that Day Junior grew to level 15. Batman grew to level 21. He's one level away. You want to save it? Yes. So, like, remind me whenever Pokemon levels up to save the game. So hopefully, hopefully, we have it saved. 
Because if not, it is what it is, starting back at City Widow. I would not stream that. I would end up just biting the bullet and doing all that myself. Who's bite? I was hoping he flinched, but his attack failed. Nice. And we're trying to catch whatever Pokemon we don't already have. I still feel that Beedrill would have been really good in that one contest, but like it's cool. I have to wait like a day or so for it to happen again. <coughs> happens again I'm gonna make sure that I record that and it'll be going up oh, bite. screech failed get bitten on Yeah, no, man. I, the, during the last locals that I went to and like got creamed, I bought a tin. Opened the tin. I got a Dark Magician Girl. I got a Dark Dragoon. Oh my god, Ante Junior, why? Go nuts. And then I got another one. Uh, what was it? Thunder Dragon level 10 or 12 or something like that. Of course you did. The Slasher. Some random gold bat. Gold bat is like whooping my ass right now. Quick attack. Nice. But I also got the Pokemon TCG game on PC here. Magic the Gathering. We're going to use this right now. Bring your ass back from the dead, boy. Because I want him to level. He needs to level. Ooh, eradicate. Level 16. Outspeeds. Heavy hit. Heavy hit. That tackle ain't no joke, man. Plus a quick attack. Gosh darn, you already outspeed me. Get out of here. Double D Gator. It's kind of like a pimp named Slipback. Nose Hyper Fang. Nose hyper bang. I feel like Radicate should get a mega evolution.
not touching nothing. Just let it happen. Let it happen. Still not touching anything. Oh my gosh. I don't care if it kills like the whole roster. That's fine. Wanna catch it. And if I do any move to it, it'll die. Because I used Leer on it a bunch of different times, right? So he's super weak. Come on. Tree go. I've used so many balls on this. Pause. I've used so many Pokeballs on this. Just get caught. Hit him with a friggin' quick attack right now, man. Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get. Still alive. Nice. Level 15. I think by about level 20, he'll be good. Because Buddy might call us. Yo, he's a macho. What? I want to catch macho. We need a macho. What level is he? 15. Because then we could have a fully, full rounded out team. Well, I guess we got Oak Tree, right? I would switch him out for my job quick time. Roll out. Focus your energy. Because you're getting rolled out on. I know we're gonna have to go all the way back, but right now we're just like training, training all our Pokemon. <sighs> Mostly Ante Jr. Slasher. Slasher! Quick attack. Get 
get hit up with another quick attack. Slasher, quick attack. Golbat's like, bat, bat. Leech life, eh? Such a bum. Another quick attack. Go. He's out here leeching life. Hits me at the supersonic. What a piece. Poison. Ah. Ah. You were doing so good. You were doing so good, Slash. You cut. Oh, he snapped out his confusion. As soon as I told him to cut. So what's your favorite mission in GTA 4? play any of the Call of Duties at all either. Because I wasn't a fan of Call of Duty, to be honest. I know a lot of people are going to hate me saying that. It just wasn't, wasn't for me. It wasn't my jam. Pretty sure there's a Pokemon Center over here. Worst comes to worst, we die, we just end up back in that town. But we're trying to get Growlithe as many levels as possible at the moment. Because we're expecting a phone call from this kid. That'll have a Firestone for us. We can evolve him into Entai. Magnitude. It's a huge move, doesn't affect Slasher though. You wanna know why? Fury Cutter. Oh ho, oh ho, your little mole nails there. Fuck Fury Cutter. Slasher. Nice, level 16. Does he have mud slap or did I give it to someone else? Gave it to someone else. Because he'll die. Go Gator. Double D Gator. That tackle on the chin like a real man. Good knocks. Let's see if I can pull a miracle right here. Hypnosis. Yes. Uh, I wish he had Dream Eater. Crit. The attack missed. Oh no. Don't let it happen again, Slasher. No. Rock throw. Oh no. Geodude, what you doing, son? Aw, oh, Slasher. Yeah, I clapped. Go Oak Tree. AKA 
hardwood. Hardwood classic. Roll out. Oh, oh, you missed cuz I'm rolling out. You had to throw rocks everywhere to hit me. Roll out. Oh, hey. Get clapped. what they look like underneath. <laughs> Go Knox. Try attack. Hit me with that. Thunder Fire Ice. scratch. Magnitude would have even been better. Nice. <sighs> scratch at me all day, Doug Trio. All day. Go ahead. God, can't believe you're doing this to Chaboy. Chaboy again, bro. Hit you with that last rollout. In your face. In your face. Oh, Alan. He just told me about his day, he doesn't have anything. Yo, isn't this where that ice badge is? What is this? become stronger when they evolve but they also learn moves more slowly I make them learn certain moves before I let them evolve because there's only certain moves your Pokemon can learn at certain levels what's this team rocket has come back I saw some men in black at a lake of rage that's where Gyarados is Yeah, this is the ice badge. Some shit in there that we can face. That's towards the Lake of Rage. Lance is up there. Favorite Radio program. I'd say Pokemon music. Cool. That's right, I could use that, but like, bruh. I'd rather give the shout out to the person on YouTube. So check out the people who, uh, who do the music. Like all the background music that you hear down in the description below, you're going to have their link tiny mushroom, an ordinary mushroom, 
slow poke tail, pokeball, potion. We make up for three. Gyarados are a big money maker. <laughs> what you say, an old man? We obviously see the Gyarados rampage late. Because you get the Dragon Fang over here, too. Get skirted past. Oh, snap. Team Rocket. Hold it there, kiddo. The toll is a thousand to go through. Thank you very much. You guys just robbed me, bro. It's my last thousand. Highway friggin' robbery. What Pokemon are up here? Do we have stronger Pokemon up here? We should, right? Centric. I think they evolved a level 15 or something. Bite. Bite, boy, bite. Well, this is perfect for us to train. Because we do need to train. We got to make some more coin. We got to do some stuff. Before we go back, we'll, then we'll do the towers. We'll do the sisters. We'll do the badge. We'll get the badge. Would you get this? Um, I can't guy made from my Pokemon. Darn it, my Pokemon's great. Fight me. Your explanation about the difference? This is kind of lame. Box defense position is fine because you have the ability to protect your face quite. To be honest, let's do karate lessons. Oh, cool, karate lessons. Now I do boxing training. Yeah, boxing is way better. Boxing is way better. Way better. Like a thousand percent better. Boxing stand up, man. Boxing's way better. I did boxing back in the day. Boxing's way better. I did judo too when I was younger. Judo was pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. Teach you how to fall correctly so that you don't hurt yourself. And like to counterbalance people's weight against them. Which is like nuts. Take their momentum, use their momentum against them. That was sick. And then that helps out. Like it translates over into boxing as well. All about the momentum, duck dodge. Not only that, but like to, to do boxing and stuff, you gotta be in pretty good shape. Right? You can't be like smoking or drinking really you have to be taking care of yourself like jump ropes no joke man doing staircases where you're jumping up stairs and stuff man bro it's ridiculous had this boxing instructor he was able to jump from the very bottom of the staircase to the top of the staircase and he was like a short dude he was like a little Filipino dude friggin fast bro he knew what he was doing he was nuts slash grew level 18 False swipes. 
What is false swipes? Nice. Glad to hear, man. I have to get back into uh into shape. I think my move set's fine. Yeah, I did a whole email thing with the gym today. I was talking to them. They're just up the street, checking out prices and stuff. And they got people there that specifically work on people that have sciatica to help them like bounce back because that's what I'm like essentially trying to do is bounce back from it like every day man kills me I did give it to that like my back kills me my leg kills me every single day and I'm trying to work that out because I feel if I get in better shape like when I was younger like a year and a half ago, bro, I was doing 500 push-ups a day. And then, like, I fell off. Your face problematic. don't have surf yet so we can't get it I think that's an evolutionary stone that's up there by a rampage of Gyarados. The crater filled up with rainwater and the lake was formed. That's the story passed on from my grandpa's great great grandpa. It used to be that you could catch lively magic card there. But I don't understand what's happening. Right, I can't get anything from him yet because I'm like not this far. I shouldn't even be over here. Fear it. Fur it. Gator. Oh man. Oh man. My, the Pokemon I want to train suck right now. Get him with that quick attack. We're just going to keep doing quick attack. And they got quick attack too, but we outspeed. Super fast, get out of here. Far fetched. Yeah, man, don't drink alcohol or smoke cigarettes, it's really bad. I do not condone people to do that. People shouldn't do that. I try to promote like a healthy lifestyle. You know what I mean? I want people to have a healthy lifestyle.
Like, there's a thing called moderation. So moderation and moderation. Yo, we caught far-fetched. He's a duck and he's holding a leak. What level is your magic card, bro? Level 10. <clears throat> Double D Gator. you're able to like start a garden man straight up start a garden the food's way better when you grow it yourself like I'm in the city I kind of want to like build something can't believe he has the level 10 characters. the fuck out of here. Like, I'm in the city, I have a balcony though, and I wanna like, I wanna make this garden pop off where like, I'm gonna build some wood up and around it, but I'm gonna get a tarp and lay the tarp down, and put the tarp around the wood, and then put it in the area, so that they won't really be able to say anything about it, because I'll be like, man, it's on a tarp, I'm not damaging the property, or whatever and if I want I can move I'll be able to move the dirt with a 24 uh, 24 what is it 24 liter bucket I just pick up some leaves from outside, bring them, bring them here, and just lay them on top of the whole garden and stuff because that protects it. During winter, on top, it ends up turning into fertilizer for it, gives it new life, lets it grow. My mom and her husband have like a huge garden, so nice. Know what else is cool too? Friggin' bee keeping. I would love to keep bees, bro. thrashing about. Double D Gator, you can take the hit. You can take it. Fucking mud slap on. What? Doesn't affect me, man. Bite him. Oh, and he flinched because he's a weak Gyarados. Level 15 Gyarados. Get that ish out of here, brah. Double D Gator. Bought it with my money. Huh? Huh, mom? Thanks. Appreciate that.
because our Pokemon gained levels. Whatever's up here super early. Super, super early. Like, I'm pretty sure we shouldn't even be over here at this moment. Screw the rules. We have cut. TM43. We'll look at the TM after. What's up, homie? Yeah, it's straight far. Here I have meditated inside me. New power has been awakened. Let me share my power with you. This is hidden power. Pokemon, take this child. Yeah, hidden power. Do you see it? It is hidden power. Told ya. It draws out the power of Pokemon for attacking. Remember this? Its type of power depend on the Pokemon using it. Didn't really need it. Cut this tree. Scyther's put in work, man. Nice. Weasley, well, how do you do? Seeing as how it's Wednesday today, I, Weasley of Wednesday, pleased to meet you. Please take a souvenir. Yeah, we got a black belt. Nice. These are the power fighting moves. I know this. That's why I wanted my child. What other Pokemon can use it? Raticate can use it. Raticate can definitely use it. Level 17 male Raticate, A. Eh? Well, Mud Slap. Fuck yeah, I can see that. If that's a crit, that's not bad. I can hit him with some mud slaps. Mud slaps. Sound like a money counter right in your face. Mud slap. Mud slap. Can't see, son. Can't see those tiny arms. Mud slap. Mud slap. Last mud slap. Stay alive. <sighs> we got him. Over at a sliver. Ah oh, man, he's pissed. Hands up. Hands up. Come on. So close. Gosh darn it. Hands up. Hands up. Come on. Come on.
just just here go to great ball how's that it's a little bit more spacious come on eradicate you're at one hp okay like shut the fuck up that's right So it's web back feet, allows it to cross rivers, searches wild areas for food. Uh, oh. Masters. Oh man, hold on. Master Splint, there you go. Because we're going to give him the black belt. We're actually going to rock that Pokemon. Oh, look, it's a Pidgeotto. on a stick. Hit it with this confused ray. Puts itself in some confusion. Haha. Uh -huh. Dumb pigeon. Oh no, he's confused no more and uses quick attack. Oh! Wow. It's not even worth it. That quick attack won't kill me. Hit him with that confuse ray. Or hit her with that confuse ray. My bad. yourself. He gets over that confusion quick, eh? I'm weak against him too. Quick attack. Any kind of bird moves will whoop me. Quick attack's not too bad. Hands up. Got it. Got Pidgeotto. We don't even need to train that Pidgey anymore. That's so why he's in the PC. So flappy. Flappy too. <laughs> flappy too, as in also. I could do TWO as in number two, but this is funny. I should have called him Big Flappy. Okay, let's 
let's go. Heal our pokes. Before we head back. Yeah, we're in an area of the game we shouldn't even be in at the moment. Which is, like, it's pretty funny. <laughs> it's a good training spot. We're here to train our Pokemon. Big buff Bidoofs all around. Bite. Bite. Flinch. Nice. Bite. Quick attack. Get that bite off. Eat that chicken. Sand attack. Oh no. Well in that case... Ah, ah, ah. Dig doesn't even work. I was just going with it. Throw sand in your face. Yeah, well, I'm gonna dig a hole. Quick attack, mess. Dig, mess. Bite. No. Bite. Nice. Come on, get beefy. If we have Pokemon Roids, unlike Rare Candies, I put them on them. To like level 32. I almost sounded like a Mario Cold Drop right there. That confused right in my pajama. Nice. Leech life. Hurt yourself. Use the minimize. Harder to hit. Nice. And with that swift. Candy bar. <sighs> Minimized again. Friggin' tiny dog. Chew toy. I'm getting slapped by an ant, bro.
Nice. Thanks for the encore. Sleeping at my show, huh? Make you do it again, encore. It's a way to drain peepees, -pee and he keeps minimizing. not gonna hit him at all. Minimizes again. Holy. Slapped out by an ant. Nice. It popped. We got it. We caught you, Clefairy. Slipping, lacking, yeah, peck this bitch, what do you mean you missed, how do you miss, how do you miss, you big bulbous owl, peck him, it's the same size as your feed, Knox, what are you doing, there you go, bud, do it one more time, one more time, hit that peck, yes, Yes. Yes. Screw you, Picnic or Tiffany. You suck. <coughs> Centroid. Centroid. Double D Gator. It's like a pimp named Shit Man. Heal my Pokemon. Every time, huh? Cool, I already bought one, bruh. I already talked to these people. I already talked to these people. Yeah, we must start heading back. It was a nice little detour to get some levels. Flinch. He's a good little ankle biter, buddy. Yes, sir. Ember. Hey, 
with that boys. Just like hurting. He's a hurting dog. Nice. And then we got this fisher. Totally. Cool fish. Go. Cool fish. This whole minimize thing, man. What? Like, what's going on here? Just a straight pack of poison stem. I feel Peck should be super effective. Because it's a fish. Poison no more. I guess this is the time to use Foresight, right? Hit him with that hypnosis. Foresight. Identified. Pack. Yeah, I should be able to hit every time now. Crit. Minimize again. Still able to notify him. Nice. Got it. Yeah, if you find some shit, you will holler at it. So we're gonna go heal up our Pokemon. This was a nice little detour. We we're able to level up a little bit. Caught a couple new Pokemon over here. We're about to head back through the cave over to where we need to be. And we're gonna complete that half of our journey. Because we got a couple things that we need to do. We've come way too far. <clears throat> so we're going to take a quick little intermission right here. Uh, get yourself something to drink. Use the washroom. Get up. Move around. Do your stretches and whatever. I'm pretty much going to go check on my cat. Make sure he's good. So I'll be right back. Uh, yeah. A couple minutes.
it's super hot. He's a black cat, you know. I gotta wipe him down. Yo, Dre, what's happening, bro? Yeah, Marco, you down for uh, GTA 6? There hasn't been any leaks of it. Perfect day for fishing. My core fish has grown again. So we got an Ekans too. We just fought that dude. Level 17. He's doing alright. Everybody's healed. Yeah, I wipe him down with like cool water. So he's not so hot. <sighs> I've been alright, Dre, just chilling, homie. I'm gonna be changing my display picture pretty soon. I'm gonna be posting a couple cards in the community section. You guys get a pick what card it is that I get a post in the picture with. And as soon as I change it for YouTube, I'm going to be changing it everywhere. All my social media platforms. TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, everything. So we're about to get back to the task at hand. We just went and leveled up NTA Junior to 17. Hopefully this dude over here will have a Firestone for us. Haha, <laughs> fresh fit. Yeah, man. Caught the new bucket hat. Just chilling. It's one of those days, you know. Throw on my tiger fucking dad shirt. <laughs> Don't. Come on. Yeah. yeah it's been a pretty good day, man. So I thought I'd dress the way I feel. Feeling good. If I'm feeling good, gotta look fresh, bro. The only thing I'm missing right now though, straight up is a backward. I need to grab a bag wood. Because after we're done doing all this over here in Pokemon, I'm gonna stop this stream. Probably gonna go get a bag wood. And then we're gonna end up streaming again. Oh, wait a sec. Yeah, we'll be streaming Duel Links after. up 100% understandable yeah for sure bro I know you know nice 18 don't need Lear See if this kid has anything for us. Give me the fire stone. Still waiting.
dehydrate, man. I was able to work out today. It's a good day. My mom came through with an early uh, birthday gift. One of those vacuum seal things for food, a backpack, or vacuum seals and stuff. Super hype about that. It's like a whole kit. Like I got a meat grinder where I can grind my own meat and stuff. Pause. <laughs> oh, we're at the dancers. Nice. I'd even be able to, uh, sous vide stuff in these bags so like I got a couple New York strips I might just go ahead backpack them and sous vide it with some rosemary thyme butter and garlic and then all I got to do is take them out and like uh, just sear them perfect medium Yeah, yo. Hit you with that dig, man. Majama, what? Super effective. Tail whip. That's what's up. That's what's up for everyone. Oh, my face. Take that, poor Wayne. Okay, we're gonna save her for last. Cause she has the Vaporeon, I'm pretty sure. Espeon, Jolteon. Well, he's electric, so dig. Digs is all it takes. Quiet. Nice. It's almost level 20. <coughs> I need that kid to call me with the Firestone. So we got the two girls left in blue that we need to deal with because one of them has a Vaporeon Umbreon, Espeon, Vaporeon I'm pretty sure Vaporeon's on the left on the left uh, Bite Not very effective but he flinched Hit him with that Ember Hoping for a burn. What about Dig? See how Dig does. It's a dark type. Dark type is weak against what steel, I think. Hit me with your tail. Burn you, bro. Get burn damage. Get burn damage. Putting the fire out with sand attack. Ah, uh, sand attack saving him, man. Lynch. 
Dig boy, dig. I might actually see if my one boy wants to get together <clears throat> real quick. Restore Pokemon HP by 20. Yeah. Beefed up. Puppy dog. Don't have any more potions. <coughs> Pardon me. Oh, Vaporeon's on this side. I thought it was the other one. I thought it would be left. Go Batman. Hopefully Batman will get a level from this. We'll get our goal bat. Okay, Confuse Raid. I'm not confused anymore. Hits me with the tail whip. Oh, confused Ray. We gotta like put a stop to that. You gotta be confused this whole round. Sorry, Vaporeon. Still able to use tackle, nice. Can't hate, can't hate. Strong constitution. Nice. Eat it, eat it, and swift it. Nice, level 22, Batman's up here. Tell me he evolves. What, Batman's evolving? Huge, huge. So how do you tell both their happiness? Because if he's happy enough, he'll evolve into a crowbat. Level up, stats okay, poison flying. He's rocking a quick claw. Doesn't say if he's happy or not. Like, I have no idea. Saving, don't turn off the power. Kovac save the game. What do you mean 
is there no permission? Got permission. Huge, huge. I'm gonna have to test it after, but that's after I complete all this. What was up with that tail movement? What the fuck? <laughs> Hit him with a bite. Shake it off. <sighs> Huge. Hit him again. Twenty. Your face, come on, old girl. Right on, nice. They also skill their Pokemon. I always challenge them, but I've never even left the scratch. The way you battled, it was like watching a dance. It was a rare treat to see. I want you to have this. Don't worry. Take it. HMO3. Nice. Double D Gator. Get more slug back. I didn't want to do that. But it's already happened. It's nothing. I'm not going to change it. It's fine. I'm not trying to synchronize swim with my Pokemon now. Alright. Oops. Oak tree is going in the PC. And we're about to pull out Master Splinter. Hyperfang and shit. He can learn surf too. Detect, attract. Now we get to see the move set. Tackle tail whip. power. Oh ho! What's going on? Hello, it's me, Alan Kovacs. Are you raising your Pokemon properly? I read in a book that you should raise any Pokemon you catch with loving care. By the way, 
who knocked out whatever Pidgey just the other day. St uh, studying up in advance worked. See you later. Let me know that you have something for me. Stop calling me. Like, I need to know. I'll repel Super Potion. We'll take the Super Potion. Alright. So, Ante Jr. is level 20. We can switch him out. He's evolved G Double D Gator. So we need Nox and Slasher and Master Splint. I want to teach him like low kick or something. Hidden Power is like up there too. Because I'm pretty sure it's good if you use the Black Belt with Hidden Power as well. to the building yet? Not yet. Oh, I'm on the trail of Pokemon names uh, Suicune. Glad to meet you. Rumors that Suicune is in this burnt tower, so I came to look. But where exactly could it be? Gosh darn right, I'm saving the game. This one's 100% safe. Morty! I think there's Grimer in here or something. Coughing, Grimer, Muck. Not my forte. This is my forte. It comes in a glass bottle that says OE oh, on the side. Rock Smash. We need Rock Smash. And we don't get Rock Smash till after the lighthouse. Because we gotta surf over where the other island is that fighting gym is. <coughs> I just know that because Shuckle. Watching the Bitleys. Good old Shuckle. Shuckle here, where he thinks he's going to evolve into something. It's like Shuckle doesn't evolve, bro. Stop this. Knock off. <coughs> About to fight our rival. Oh, it's you. I came looking for some legendary Pokemon. Let they say ro roosts here. But there's nothing here. Nothing after all the trouble of coming to this dump. No way. It's all your fault. Okay. Word. Victim blaming here. Trying to gaslight me, son. It's badass that he has a haunter, though. I can't hit on that. He has a he has a haunter. So hypnosis can work. And then I could foresight him. And then my attacks will work on him. Can't leave. Found you, son. Get identified. Foresight was reduced by five. Oh yeah, that's right. Almost 
almost 50. It was worth it. Nice. I'll deal with that. That's fine. Whatever. Stay asleep, Hunter. Stay asleep with your red hands. Oh, stay asleep for like one more turn. Come on, crit. Crit. Come on, Knox. Crit. Crit, Knox. Crit. Crit it. Crit it. Crit, crit, crit. crit. Nice. Level 20. Pretty sure he evolved. Yes. Well, dig work. Should, right? Unless it's some like bullshit logic. Nice. Hit him with that dig. Good boy. Yeah. Oh, you, oh, you, you got a zoo bat? <laughs> I had a zoo bat. Screw your zoo bat, homie. That's what's up. That's what's up. Hit you with that bite. My big old jaw just coming down on you. And he's confused. Hurts himself. Get bit one more time. Should be the end. Yeah, yeah. Bay leaf, you say? Bay leaf? This plant Pokemon? He is level 22, though. Two levels higher than mine. Shouldn't matter. We all sped. <sighs> Huge. Uh, if the burn kicked in too, it would have been nuts. Didn't even have to use my double D gator. Bam. Yeah, we definitely need the Firestone. All his Pokemon are whimps in his eyes. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. I knew it. Level 20. Knocked Owl. Aw, oh, whatever. Even my Pokemon evolves in front of him. All that. <laughs> Aw, oh, man. My Pokemon suck. It's like, yo, shush. Shush your mouth, bro. What are you doing falling into a hole? Some genius you are. Yeah. Serves you right. Because I suck at raising my Pokemon. Okay, well.
gonna come say what up real quick, nah? Yeah? What's happening? Sorry, yeah, you run away. I'm not strong enough. Got this weird guy blocking my way now. We've seen race by in front of his eyes. For Ten years he's chased that Pokemon and he finally got to see it. I'm all choked up. Kovacs, I'll give this all to you. Thank you. I heard that you're the legendary Pokemon of Aerotech. Test chosen humans by allowing them to get close. I'm going to track. I'm going to track Suicune. Uh, Let's meet again. Farewell. Very well, good bar. Coffee, man. No one wants you. Not even worth the battle. If I had strength, rock smashing strength, I'd have to come back. to the gym. Get those gains. You can heal my Pokemon. Thanks, Nurse Joy. Appreciate you. Time to use the washroom. Take two minutes, stretch out all that, whatever. I gotta go change my cat's water. I'll be right back. We're about to kick it off with this gym right here.
Yeah. All right. Back at it. Let's do this. Oh yeah, it's that side to side. No, I'm going to check that right after this stream. Thanks for reminding me. I've been super busy. None of my attacks will hit Wally. Well, this one might. Yeah. Okay. Slasher doesn't run from nothing, homie. Yeah, I'm going to check that right after this stream, Marco. Has the ghastly lineup. I don't know why he used mean look. If like I've already had mean look done on me, can't go anywhere. But yeah, yo. So I'm gonna continue going through uh, my Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I'm gonna make some packs to go for like all the extra cards because I'm keeping play sets, right? I'm gonna keep the play sets, but whatever extra I have are gonna be going in packs and sent out to you guys. So you guys will end up getting a couple random cards and like one uh, one hollow until I could like decrease the stack because I have tens of thousands of cards, man. that and plus I gotta open a pack the other day you see that I open up a pack and I got a blank card in it hopefully it's good luck I might even have that as a prize because uh, on the shorts I was opening up a, a Yu-Gi-Oh booster pack I think it was the 13th pack I opened it up and I had a blank card in there in there all white it's an ink smudge on the one side where, like, you know it was supposed to get printed on, but it never got printed on. Okay. I see it. See, look. One, two, over, up. Maybe that's just how ingrained it is in my head. Haunter is such a sick Pokemon. Like everyone gives Gengar love, but Haunter, bro. Haunter is a jokester. He's the one that makes Sabrina laugh. You know? Brings her out of her slump. He won't die. I'll be cursed, though. I'm pretty sure homie up here has one Gengar, or he might have two Gengars. It's either two Haunters or two Gengars. Hurt by that curse, man. Still super effective. Oh no, he hit me with the lick. Don't paralyze me. Fuck. You got paralyzed, Joe.
you're waiting like everybody else for the information about GTA 6 and you think that it'll outdo Red Dead 2 in every aspect. I don't know, man. I don't know. Red Dead 2 is a masterpiece in my book. Like that game, that game for the time that it came out is a masterpiece. Same with like God of War. God of War 2. That game's a masterpiece as well. Battlefield 4 was a masterpiece. A lot of people play it today, but it kind of fell off because it's an older game. And then they fully sh like shot themselves in the foot making the new one, 2042. That game sucks. <laughs> I went and I played like I played all the Battlefield games and like, bro. And it's up over, I think. A hella beautiful masterpiece? It could be. It has potential. But it's like that one game. What was it? Cyberpunk. Everyone was super hyped about for the graphics and stuff. And it was subpar. Same with... Uh, Man, I forget the name of the, the, name, the name of the game. You're going around with like a cell phone, and you were like hacking systems and stuff. I forget the name of it, but like its gameplay was so clunky. Like we did, like they just wanted to shove it out, get their payday, and then it's like ah, the devs will fix it after. It's like that's no way to be, man. No way to be. Watch Dogs. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, none of his attacks will hit. Ah, I fuck. I meant to go to Ember. Oh shit! Bite works. That's cool. I didn't know that. So when we get to him, we're going to have to go directly right. You know what else used to be a really good game? Whereas, uh, Rainbow Six Las Vegas. In my opinion, that game was really, really good. So was Splinter Cell and stuff. Like, there's a bunch of games that you could consider, in your own opinion, to be masterpieces. Because, like, not everybody will agree with it. Nice. Like, uh, old school Banjo Kazooie, love that game. The game was a masterpiece, in my opinion. Same with 007 Goldeneye, crazy good game. Great, a perfect dark. It was a really good game, too. Zelda Majora's Mask, masterpiece, in my opinion. I liked the Time one, too, Oracle of Time, but it wasn't the same. It didn't feel the same to me. Majora's Mask, that was like. Okay, it's crunch time. Conqueror's Bad Fur Day was really good too for the 64. Turok. Turok was dope. Yeah, 64 had a bunch of dope games. And then, like, PlayStation was like Metal Gear Solid. Uh, a bunch of 
BMX games and like motocross games that I played were sick. Uh, Grand Theft Auto games, of course. Way to kill yourself, Hunter. Oh, Killer Instinct was a really dope game for like Sega Genesis. Same with like Mortal Kombat and stuff. That was so sick. Street Fighter for the SNES. I'm old, man. <laughs> All the Sonic games were sick for like Sega Genesis. It was really dope. When the Dreamcast came out, like everyone thought that that was going to be a hit, but nah, nah. And like the GameCube too. I feel like GameCube shouldn't have come out at all. They should have kept the 64 and just improved on it because the 64 had online capability. Because over in Japan, they were playing on the Nintendo 64 online with each other. Like Pokemon Stadium and stuff. That was another game. Freaking Pokemon Stadium. Huge. And then you had like Duel Academy. You had, uh, I forget the name of it, but it's like, you're the Pharaoh. And you got a duel back in Egyptian times and whatever. It was pretty cool, man. Friggin' Slasher, my G. Okay, let's switch it up. We could teach Slasher a bunch of, like, fighting moves, like karate chop and stuff, but... I think it would look dumb with a black belt. Maybe the headband. Like an Afro Samurai. Curse yourself. Just to curse my puppy. And then get clapped by him. Gengar. Here we go. That's an awesome animated Gengar. I like the way how they portray Gengar in uh, silver, gold, silver, gold, crystal, and like any game after. He looked really dope. It's one of these Dream Eater. Uh, yo, Double D Gator. I wish I kept my slap. <sighs> Dream Eater's gonna kill it. And he stayed asleep. Oh man. Oh man. I think this is where we're gonna get clapped a bit over here with Gengar. Master Splinter can't do anything. I know he can't. He can use Hidden Power. Hypnosis is going to hit like every time though. We're going to be stuck here for a minute. But it gives us an opportunity to level up our Pokemon. We want that kid to call. His health would have been all the way back up to. Nox might stand a chance. Never mind. Hypnosis is hitting. 
every time. Every time. With Dream Eater. Like, every time. And he won't wake up. Yeah, I figured. He's already asleep. I forgot about that. Ugh. Ugh. Come on, outspeed Gengar. Outspeed him. Yeah, we're all our Pokemon are about to get clapped here. Gengar is tough. Gengar is tough. We all know how tough Gengar is. Oh my god, he missed. Miss again. In effect. Oh my god, come on, come on. No, no, no. <laughs> We're so close. So close. Slasher, you're you're a superstar. Come on. So much, so much. Fuck you, Gengar. So that just happened. That just happened. One of my favorite Pokemon, Gengar, but like, come on, bruh. Come on, bruh. Come on, bruh. <laughs> I don't have magnitude on him. Let's take a look at the PC real quick. Hidden power would work, but... He was a Kadabra. If I had a fucking Kadabra or a Haunter myself. Get these levels then, because then we could quick level through this. Let's abuse the game. Good of you to have come here in was that Ecritech Pokemon? Okay, well, whatever. Shut up. Let's battle, son. Secretly using you to train with. So Gastly's cake. Double D Gator. Hit him with that surf. Let him know what them waves do. OTK. Nice. Don't need to switch, not yet. Oh, speed, oh, speed. 
Nice shade. Won't kill me. Hurt me. Won't kill me. Hit you with that surf though. It probably won't kill him, but it's going to do a hell of a lot more damage than what he did to me. And then Gengar is next. Oh man, I hope we outspeed Gengar. Yo, what's up, see nice change him out. We're going to keep doing what we're doing. I mean, look, nice. We have a chance here. Gengar is the biggest hurdle that we need to get over. Like your arm in the 90s. Nice. Missed. Come on. Rock the shit out of Gengar. Get out of here, Gengar. Double D Gators out here, bruh. Fuck. That hypnosis, though. Okay, so he's gonna get ready to use Dream Eater. Oh, yeah, that's right, the mean look. That's the worst. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. No! Come on, yes! See you, bitch. Stay asleep. Stay asleep, stay asleep, stay asleep. Nice! We got over Gengar. Hopefully he doesn't have a second Gengar. I think it's a Haunter. Yes! I'm okay with that. We got it. Oh, Resident Evil? Resident Evil is sick, bro. Love that game, too. It's a really good game. I have two summers this year. Bruh. It's that hot over there. Oh yeah, man. When I was younger, me and my friends used to play Resident Evil. Like when it first came out for PlayStation, we were playing that, man. And that was a really, really intense, good game for the story and everything. We played at nighttime, turn off all the lights, just have the glow of the TV, we'd be there just playing. <coughs> Pardon me. And then jump scares would happen and stuff. It's nuts. Yo, we did it, guys. We did it. We did it. There's a bunch of running around, leveling up and stuff, but we fucking did it. We did a bunch. 
we got a couple new Pokemon that have been evolved. We're waiting on this gosh darn Firestone. Give me that Fog Badge. Let's me use Surf now. Give me TM30. It is classified as a horror game. It doesn't seem that scary. When you're a little kid, it is. It's super scary when you're a kid. Because me and my friends, like I said, man, we used to turn out all the lights and play it. But we were mad young when it came out. It was cool because I had a NES with like Super Mario games, Final Fantasy and stuff like that. My one boy had the PlayStation, my other buddy had uh, the Sega Genesis. We had another friend who had the Super Nintendo system. It was it was a crazy time growing up where I grew up, how I grew up. But anyway, so we completed everything that we needed to. We're overriding it right now. We've been doing a bunch of hard saves for it too, which I'm going to do right now. Save as. Save. Pokemon Crystal already exists. Do you want to replace it? Yes. So we have replaced the hard save file. But until next time, man, thanks for rocking with your boy. I appreciate you coming out plays a Pokemon. Sorry about the whole situation the other day with the rolling blackouts of what it came on. Uh, I'm going to do some stuff. I want to see if a buddy of mine wants to get together because if he wants to get together I'll go out and see him real quick. If not I'll be back and we'll play some Duel Links. Alright? So either until next, well until next time, but either until tomorrow or next time. Hope you guys take care of yourselves. Uh, take care of each other.